The country has never fulfilled its promises of freedom, liberty, and justice for all. It's always been freedom, liberty, and justice for some. And usually that some is uh, white people. Our worst hypocrisies are our best evidence that we have ideals at all. You take a look at other countries. Nobody ever calls the Chinese Communist Party a hypocrite or China a hypocrite or Iran a hypocrite. Why is that? Because to be a hypocrite, <laughs> you at least had to have ideals in the first place. But a lot of and and ideas- so we're imperfect, but we are about the pursuit of a more perfect union, the pursuit of happiness. America's about the pursuit. And so I, I think are the trashing are- ourselves, I, I think we oh, are actually. I say that is because, you know, we, we never were included in those ideals originally. Like, originally. Yeah, but yeah. never and not originally are two different things. Mm-hmm. Originally, that's true. Mm-hmm. Over 250 years of progress, if you had somebody who was in 1870 looking at the world we live in today, if you had somebody in 1960 who was looking at the world we live in today as it relates to race in America, we would be darn close to what they would have thought of as the promised land. 